Hello. Some children I did a show for, they made me a thank you present. They made me my very own unique pack of cards. They drew all the backs themselves and they drew their own faces. Well, not their own faces, that would be strange, but on the playing cards they drew the faces as well. Some are easier to work out than others. That would be the three of spades, correct? And the hardest one of all is the queen of clubs, well done. This is what happens when you give 10 year olds a job. They come back with these very creative solutions, you see. We can still do a card trivia play. Here, if you were to touch one of these cards, say that one for example, you see what it is? Ah, oh, one of my favourites, the Three of Hearts. If we take the Three of Hearts and rub it on the magic vein, which is that one there, then it prints itself, which is quite cute. But it still has a rather strange back design, and the Jack of Spades is in trouble as is the Seven of Diamonds and the Eight of Hearts, unless we cast a magical shadow, which is a left-handed move, so I shall reposition the cards. That was it. It does now mean the Three of Hearts has this rather pretty back design. Oh, and the Jack of Spades is printed, and the Seven of Hearts, all the cards have sorted themselves out now. Now we have a deck, we should probably do a card trick with it. Say so stop somewhere please. Just there, perfect. Have a look at the card, I shan't peek. Remember the card, and keep saying it over and over in your mind's words. Keep saying Four of Diamonds, Four of Diamonds, Four of Diamonds. Was it really my word? You see, even though these are the perfect playing cards, they're not the cards the children made for me. The cards the kids made for me look much more like this with the strange pictures and the bizarre backs. So I think that's how I'll probably keep it if it's uh, okay with you.